Hey guys, it's Brandon Voice Requests here, Brandon Bunyard, with a second night of Five Nights. Wow, okay, my second night of the Five Nights at my job at Freddy Fazbear's. Uh, what can I say about Five Night 1? Boring. Yeah, boring. Nothing happened. I uh, ended up being on YouTube looking up random videos from Markiplier, PewDiePie. Uh, tribute to you guys, uh, tribute to Markiplier, PewDiePie, Yami Mash, and all those guys. Um, I'm gonna cut this video short. It's 11. It's 11:40. I got here 11:30. Got my uh, got a few pizza boxes of pizza, full of pizza. Like it was warm, but not lukewarm. Uh, not too hot either. Uh, when I got in there, I was getting ready. I was thinking about taking some soda. And then I saw these huge liters, like gallons, I think. They were a gallon of Mountain Dew. And a note attached to one of them saying, Hey, got this for you. You know, if you go with your pizza or something. Uh, the other free, the other sodas are for you. The other sodas are for you too, you know. Just, we are going to throw them out anyways. But I ended up not needing those. I actually have the, the gallon from the first night at my house. Yeah, that's how much they were. There was. Was. Uh, he also added if I wanted if I wanted uh, to get some monster or something, all I had to do was ask him. You know, pick up a case on his shift and drop it off for me. Like before, when I got there, I'd, it'd be there for me. But I, I don't know. I, I might do that, but I might not. I'm the kind of guy that doesn't really ask for stuff. Um. Okay. God, the man animatronics freaked me out. I swear to God, I thought one moved. Okay, give me a second. That fucking Chica, I swear to God. It's like she watches me. Every time I go by the kitchen, it's like her head shifts. Like, what are you doing? You going by my fucking kitchen? I, I did that. When I was walking by, I forgot not to stand so close to them. And I heard a, like something like something was moving. Like like, a, like a, a rusty... Like something mechanical moving. And I look over, and I see Chica staring right at me. As I was entering the kitchen, and I was like, wait, why would she care? And I look up, and I think I mentioned this in the first video, but I forgot. This is Chica's kitchen, so I guess that's her territory or something. Like, she don't want no one near it. So, yeah, that's when I got my pizza. I was just, I just kind of burst it off as a free roaming thing, and I stand kind of, you know. And as I turned around, I shit you not, Chica was staring at me again. I just kind of turned around and she, you know, I'm well, not saying anything weird or anything. I'm just saying that that duck chicken freaks me out. Oh, Freddy and Bonnie were okay, you know. Uh, I will say this: I was, I, was, I played a few games at the arcade. I mean, I Bonnie didn't seem to mind. I think you know, I it'd be kind of funny if Bonnie be like. <laughs> You know, because I think that's that's his place. Uh, the the games are freaking fun. It's more Freddy Fred uh, Fazbear oriented, and uh, give K give Y, you know, Atari sixty four style. There was this weird sound every few seconds. It was like, boom, boom, boom. Better that there are some fun games. I did see one a few games that weren't. Fazbear oriented, but they were in the back. There was Mortal Kombat, Dragon's Quest, I'm not kidding, uh, they even had a Mario one, it was really fun. But, anyways, I'm getting off track here. Um, first night was boring. You know, I was on YouTube most of the time with the laptop that the guy actually gave me. This guy is really cool. He gave me the lap, he gave me his laptop, which over, which, which can charge for about five nights straight. Which he says it does. Um, uh, he says he he says keep your eye on Pirate Cove. You'll be keeping your eye on Pirate Cove ninety percent of the time. Uh, something about foxies, the the fox over there, the pirate fox, doesn't like to not be watched. Kind of a diva in my opinion. Whenever the cameras are in use, there's a little red light that comes on. And it's only when the light, the camera that I'm looking through. So, every so often, Foxy would look out and he would monitor to see if the light's on. 
every so often. I don't know how they can scan that, but apparently he can. He knows when the light's on. Because he'll close it and he'll. You know, you don't want the thing being fully open and a little sign saying, be back in a minute. That means he's out. You don't just walk around and stop. He sprints towards the, the security room. And he says he gives you a fright. He says, if you don't want to get scared, just keep on him. Now you're asking, why should I keep, why should I spend so much attention about the animatronics? Well, he says, if you work there for 40 plus years, you will actually, that's about him smelling. But they don't smell. The guy was never supposed to, to, to actually smell them. But he said, if you, if you work there singing the same old songs and doing the same old thing for 20, 40 plus years, you deserve a little respect too. So try and just give them the right respect that's needed. Or give them the respect that's deserved. So train them basically like all the other plugs. So I do. Um, wow, time is just drifting away. Uh, I'm kind of excited for night two. I don't know what's going to happen though. Night one, I was a little at ease, but I was really bored. I was watching YouTube, watching Markiplier. All those cool guys. Shoutouts to you guys, dude. Uh, I think I did that before. I don't know. When I'm here, I just kind of forget stuff. Uh, back in the waiting area. You know. Um, the fellow I just mentioned something else. Uh, if you... If I mentioned this twice, I'm really sorry. I, if you... I'm going to put this on Facebook. I'm sorry if I, if I didn't put the second one on Facebook. Or the first one on Facebook. But I was just really tired. If you wanted after an after response of my night here for day night three put it in response for this video and i'll be sure to post the response at around six right when i get off of six six ten i'll put it here and that's when uh my shift ends and the actual voice guys begin so i'll probably video it after i talk with him and stuff so uh yeah uh, I'm going to stop this video right now. Uh, if I didn't mention anything, I'll probably mention it next night. Um, so yeah. Um, this is it. Night 2. I'm excited and I'm ready to do it. I'm going to be bored. But I'll probably watch more uh, YouTube videos and stuff. See what next video Markiplier or PewDiePie or other guys have. Uh, again, shout out to you guys. And this is me, Brandon Bunyard. Brand new voice request saying, Night 2, wish me luck.